Anthony, thank you. Well, to our other top story that we're following for you, the murder of Precinct 4 Deputy Maher Husseini. Now, Husseini was gunned down in the middle of the afternoon. This happened yesterday along Richmond and Fondren over in southwest Houston. Now, the search for the suspect led, to a gal led us to Galveston, and then the suspected killer was in the water. Since then, he's been in the hospital in the custody of Galveston police. Fox 26's Leslie Delaspor is in Galveston with what happens next. Leslie. Yeah, as of now, that suspect is not in the Galveston County Jail, but the Galveston County Sheriff explains to us what the next steps will look like once that suspect is released from the hospital and brought here. We'll do a screen test on him with the medical and make sure all the paperwork's correct. And at that point, we'll sign off on him, book him in the facility, and have a magistrate notified so they can come do a magistrate warning on him. According to the Galveston District Attorney's Office, the suspect could be charged with evading in a motor vehicle before crashing into the water near the Galveston Causeway after he was spotted by U.S. Marshals in this general area along Broadway between the Home Depot and Elliott Electrical Supply. Sheriff Trossesette says getting him back to Harris County will also be a process. Yeah, at that point, it's up to Harris County or the constable's office, whomever may want to come down and serve the warrant if they have one in Harris County to either let him stay here to meet his requirements from all of his charges in Galveston County or to be transported back up to Harris County. Now, the Galveston County Sheriff says if Harris County would like their help in transporting a suspect back, they will do so. And at 6, I'll have more on those possible charges and what those penalties could look like for the suspect. Live outside the Galveston County Jail, Leslie Delaspore, Fox 26 News.